Welcome back, my tits. Hopefully, you did not miss me for too long. How are you guys doing today? What's the 411? What's the <coughs> cheese meal of the day? Let me know in the comments below. But of course, you already know the drill. If you're not having such a good day, if you have too much negativity going on in your life, let's drop that and bring some positivity into your life. I am so excited for this video because I have a lot of stuff to get done. I have a whole day ahead of me. It is currently about to be 12. I woke up like at 10. I actually ended up sleeping over at Alan's and Danny's house. So I literally just got back right now and I need to get some stuff done here at home first. So with that being said, I will bring you guys along with me today. Many of you guys know about my car registration situation. <laughs> if you guys don't know, a little recap. I ended up getting pulled over. They told me that my registration was expired for two years and that I need to go get it fixed. And they gave me a fixed ticket, which I have to go take to a DMV and take it to the police station. I only have to pay $25 apart from what I have to pay for my car registration and it will be off my record. I gotta do that. It is a Friday, so hopefully it's not as packed. It has literally been raining, so if you guys live in OC, the rain has been pretty obscure, honestly. It's been a little cranky. I don't know what's going on. Like, it's having its mood swings. Hopefully it's just not busy. That's my point. Hopefully it's not busy. I don't want it to be busy. I'm gonna do my laundry, and these are the shoes that Alan ended up getting me for Friendsmas with the girls, if you guys haven't seen. But look at how beautiful these are. I've been needing nice white shoes like this. Thank you, Alan, for my new shoes. I'm gonna be wearing these very soon for sure. And then just needing to put all my junk away. This is the laundry that I did the other day and I didn't finish folding. And then this is the stuff that I had at their house and here. Oh, I have my gift for my mom. So let's actually place that under the Christmas tree so I could show you guys how my mom decored it and how my sister did actually. Mira, tienen dinero, ya están los regalos, mira nomás. These are big gifts. What are you guys giving out? Well, my dad, I have to wrap his soon, but right now I have my mom's wrapped right now. So I'm just gonna go ahead and place that right there. But look at how cute the tree is. Your traditional, you know, tree, I would say, I guess, I don't know. But Loki, I do need to eat. Because I'm getting asked. It's not the hanging chorizo. Big. My house is hella Mexican. Yeah, I live in a very Hispanic home, which I love. I feel very homey here. So hopefully you guys feel homey too. I have my leftover tuna melt from yesterday. And I didn't end up eating the other half for the remainder of the day. Because we were literally out all shopping. Me and Alan and Danny. We were out shopping all day yesterday. So I'm going to eat the leftover of this. This is the sandwich. And this is actually on a sourdough bread. So it is really, really good. Let's close her up. Uh, toast reheat. Six minutes. I think that should be good. Uh, oh, there we go. Didn't have to do anything. Six minutes. I'm going to finish fucking doing my laundry. So let's get to it. Okay, so I ended up folding all my laundry. It was just a small pile and I need to undo this. And just on time for my sandwich. So I could go ahead and eat that real quick because she needs the energy for the day. Ooh, that looks so delicious. I'm going to try some of it with you. But I low-key can not need a hurry because I'm on a time crunch. I need to leave here before 1. And it's like 11.30. Mm. Mm. They add these little, like, huevito thingies. And I don't know what that is. But that's really good. I'm going to go finish what I can. And I'm going to shower and start getting ready. I'll see you guys in one second. Okay, slow transition there, but I am fully ready now. I have my glam on and ready to head out because she was trying to leave at one. It's already about 2.30 and I'm barely leaving the house to the DMV. So I'll show you guys my outfit over there, but overall I will see you guys at the DMV. Okay, so I made it here to the DMV. The parking lot is literally full and there is a line outside, but let me show you guys my outfit real quick. My hair is so wet and kind of frizzy because of the weather and I let it air dry, so don't mind that. But let me show you guys my outfit. Very simple, very comfy. These, these. My platforms, Crocs, some jeans, and this sweater. Literally, I haven't worn it like in a while and it's actually fitting looser and looser, so I'm so happy. But let's go ahead and head inside. 
and see how this goes. I made it here to the DMV in Fullerton. I know this is probably not the best one. This is the closest to where I can go and I just needed to done, get done ASAP and it's close to the police station so that works. But the line did go down a little bit so hopefully it doesn't take too long to get everything processed. Damn, my hair looks really frizzy. I have my ticket right here so we'll see what they tell me. I'm scared. Hi, so I ended up getting a ticket due to my registration and they said to give this to you and they would, I don't know, there was something about that. There's one that you, you can see, I don't know which one it is. Yeah, I know, it's like pretty well, you can screwed up. And see it. Yeah, but it's a CV. Did they something. tell you to send it to, sign, to get a sign? Basically, first I had to get my registration fit situated and then so to go to the... Did you take care of the registration or not yet? Not yet. Then they can do everything at the same time. Perfect, okay, so it's separate. Cool. Well, same window can help you. Got it. Alright, sending your text and All right. you can wait outside. Perfect. When you get the second one, then you can come back. Again. Okay, thank you. Have a good day. Thank you, you too. Thank you. See you. You guys, I'm so sad. <laughs> it's gonna be a fucking long ass fucking wait. <sighs> God. Now I have to wait for the second fucking text message, which I guess I don't mind because I guess I could be in my car and she broke it up a little bit. <laughs> It's okay, we're fine. But I am number B279, so I guess we wait. And then also, you guys, I've been meaning to show you guys, but literally, I've been so occupied and I just keep forgetting. Not gonna lie, I just keep forgetting. But I wanted to show you guys my nails. My nails are low key um, fucked up already because I've been not taking care of them at all. Like, I literally put them on the webbles, like, literally so quickly that. I've just been keep on gluing them back on, but it works. They're still on. This is the one side of nails, the Grinch right here. How cute. I know, I know. And the one that did them, of course, is Malvadas underscore 5150, my girl. She always does amazing sets. So literally, if you guys want to get your little set, her Instagram is down below in the link or in the description below. But then this is the other side. I'm missing this one because it just popped off this morning and I forgot it at Ellen's and Danny's house. But this one's the one with Max. Look at how cute he looks. Still waiting in the car. I haven't received the second text yet. So hopefully we get in there soon because the police station closes like at six. And I want to try to make it beforehand because I don't want to get pulled over and like them tell me anything so yeah but at least i'm here at the dmv because girl how much more was i gonna prolong this not long because soon enough this ticket was gonna expire and i couldn't like hold off on it and i had to wait to get paid okay today's a day and now after i pay this i'll have an estimate of okay how much can i spend to finish the remainder of the christmas gifts and hopefully it's over i'm gonna Hopefully it's not. Hopefully they have a payment plan option, actually. That's what I'm hoping for. I just got the second text that is going to call my name shortly. So I'm going to head to the front and hopefully I get in soon. But um, I'll see if I'm able to record because I don't know how like strict they are with that. But yeah. Oh, yeah. I made it inside. Now to find a seat if I find a seat. I found the spot. It's not as packed inside. My number has been called 21. I just saw an old prima right now. Oh, it was so nice seeing her, but hopefully I get to see her after so I can like catch up with her and stuff. But I'm here at my window. Hi, how are you? Hey, hello. How can I help you today, miss? So I'm here to figure out my vehicle registration just because I haven't received anything in the mail and I actually got pulled over the other day and they told me about it. Okay, do you have your uh, plate number by any chance? Oh, yes. Nice. Uh, name? Alma. Okay. You still have the same address, right? Yeah, can we confirm the address? So we're working on a kind of a dated system. Uh, I gotta crunch some numbers. Yeah, no, go for it, go for it. You have some money on the account, right? You have $350 on the account. It's gonna be like $200 for the registration fee. But 10 citations on the account. $300 okay question do you mean that something about my account that I have pre like credit on my account or what do you mean by that and I overpaid it basically okay but that means that I'm was up to date last year right yeah, but it still needed to come back with the spot. Oh. Would I have received something for that? Because I never received anything or like, was it in the paperwork when they gave it to me? Yeah. 
Got it. Okay, that makes sense. They're asking for a smog too. Okay. So you need to get a smog from them? You didn't get the smog here. Not yet. I wasn't they didn't I didn't know about that. And it's gonna be nine hundred and forty. With everything, yeah, paid, like, I'm up to date, nothing to worry. Oh. Loki, I was expecting to pay $1,400. Is there payment options? No, no, I mean, like, because I want to do this in two separate transactions. Okay. So it wipes out the tickets. Okay. It's going to be uh, $234. I like that. <laughs> Uh, here's all your paperwork back. I stamped it because you paid already. Okay. This is like a to-do list. As you already know, it's like you just need to get a smog, bring it back in person Tuesdays, Thursdays. Especially if you come like before we close, like on five. They usually give you one, but I'm giving you like three. Uh, these are like one day moving permits because right now it, your registration is still not valid yet until you bring the smog back. Okay. Oh okay. my god. Yeah. Thank you so much. No Perfect. Perfect. Set, all right. Thank you. You've been amazing. Yeah. No worries. I so try to help so much. You made my day with that prize. <laughs> you have a good day. Bye. I'm me acting like if I like won a deal or something like that. Like if I fucking convinced him to lower my fucking registration, dude. But I'm so happy. I literally thought I was gonna pay a thousand four hundred, but I only paid nine hundred eighteen. I'm so happy. Now I could actually finish some Christmas shopping. I will so uncomfortably and probably get my dad a nice cologne and probably maybe get myself a little something with this extra money. Oh my gosh, he's rich. Ah, uh, bitch, barely. Good thing. He was very nice, very patient with me. I greatly appreciate this fool named Alex. His name is Alex here at Fullerton. So, you know, shout out to Alex at DMV at Fullerton for helping me out on this shit because, girl, si no, they were gonna haul my fucking car. I'm gonna go and actually try to see if I could get a smog check really quickly. So I could probably even go probably tomorrow back to the DMV and finish this off. Okay, so I made it here to the little smog area. My hair literally looks like a mess, bitch. I look fucking crazy. I need to brush it out. That's what I need to do. My little car is right there. I called my dad and asked him how much they should charge. And they were like, oh, 60 is good. And I came right here and they were gonna charge me 45. So very happy, very content with the price. Saving more money each time. But yeah, so I'm gonna get that going. They closed at five, the DMV here. So hopefully maybe I could make it the last five minutes, but We'll see. So I just left the smog check. It is 5.50 and I'm going to try to see if they will actually take me in this last minute. So hopefully that is the case. We will see right now. I am literally speed walking, hoping that they'll take me in, bitch. Because I really, I really don't want to come back. Like, especially before the holidays, girl. Like, come on. I just did my smog check. So I just want to see what to do my registration real quick. Thank you. Okay, 349, new number. Now let's hope and see if we get my registration. Now I don't have to worry about police pulling me over or anything. So my number is called up 18. Oh my God. I wonder if I'll get the same guy because it's close to his window, but he's gonna be so proud of me because he did my smog check. Hi, how are you? I'm good, thank you. So I'm here to do my registration. I was here earlier and I did my smog check. I think this is the paperwork you need. Thank you. Oh, thank you. You yeah, today, right? Yes, barely today. Yeah, literally, like probably 30 minutes ago. Okay, let's double check. Okay, a new vacation until 2024. Perfect. You pay this amount. Mm -hmm. You stick it. Mm -hmm. And we break down why you pay this amount. All right. So everything's paid now. Yeah. Thank you so much. Happy you holidays. Next, yeah. I know. I'll see you next year. Let's make sure I do it on time this time. <laughs> That's for sure. You have a good day. I got my registration. I got my registration. Now to the police station to get my ticket signed so I could be safe to drive. I am so proud of myself. Okay, thank you. Have a good day. I'm listen pizza because I don't want to be getting there at the police station and they be like, oh no, we closed 30 minutes before. Bitch, bye. I'm so happy for myself. I'm so proud of myself. I only paid $918. Okay, as you guys can see, I made it to the police station in Fullerton. So let's see if they'll even take me in and I could get this situated. I'm really proud of myself for getting all this done, but at the same time, I'm like uh, stressing because I still want to shop around. So I mean, who fucking knows how that's gonna turn out. Who is it? 
A fixed ticket? For what? Uh, registration. Do you need the ticket? Yes. It is a little bit borroso, hopefully. I don't know. When did you get this ticket? Like, probably three weeks ago. I just didn't have the money to pay the registration. Where is that vehicle? It's right in front. But I know my license plate if you need it. Did you get the tabs on it? The what? Do you have the tabs on it? The tags? Yeah. I literally just came from the DMV. Let me double check your uh, car out and then... Yeah. I don't want to keep that. Oh, cool. Are you going to be able to handle like this little sign off thingy or is it a whole process? Okay, cool. <laughs> right here. Okay. The inspector area? All right. You're going to go take that over there, okay? Perfect. Thank you. I know. They have anxiety. This is the area that I had to park. So this is the first time I've had this situated, but I don't know if he's going to meet me here outside or... Am I gonna go inside or I'm I'm confused. My friend. I think to meet him back inside. I'm gonna go off with that. Oh my god, I'm horrible at following directions. I'm gonna rewatch this and then I'll be like, girl, you're fucking chaotic. Like Yeah no shit, honey! Figure your shit together at least. How's the day been so far? Pretty good, I'm so uh, hectic. I didn't think I was gonna be at the DMV for too long, but it's it's expected. That's yeah. what I get for waiting for everything last minute. No. I all do the fucking anxiety that I have going to police stations. Courthouse is closed, meaning that I'll have to go on Tuesday to finish this completely, but overall that is set. Now it's time to go to Allen's and no, actually I don't know. I'm gonna have to see my list. Okay, I totally forgot I was vlogging for you guys. My hair, I actually finally brushed it out, but I actually just went to Hot Topic over there and got Alan some stuff to finish his little gift. Well, not really, still need to finish it. And now I'm going to Doc Martens because Danny has been wanting some shoes. So hopefully I do find them there. Wish me luck. I made it here to the Doc Martens. So it seems like they do have them because the girl in the front, she was like, oh yeah, for sure. I mean, it seems like they do have them. And then the guy right here, he was like, oh, yep, got you. Let's go. And I'm like, oh my God, okay. But now it's time to pay, which will hurt, but it's for the my besties. They deserve the best because they already do a lot for me. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Good. Thank you, you too. <sighs> okay, guys. I got Danny's Doc Martens. Ow! I'm tripping everywhere. Thank you. Have a good one. Now let's head downstairs where Zoomies is at and i don't know what other store but we'll see right now okay i made it to zoomy no right zoomies i don't know and i found these two shirts two for 40 so not too bad i've been slacking so hard on updating you guys but i literally got here at sephora at kohl's i should have gone to sephora over there at the mall but it was like packed as fuck but i got my dad his little regalito i overspent a little bit but nothing but zip pay helps but now i'm gonna end up going to big lots and then to target and then to get something to eat and now head to Owens and danny's house so i could do the hydro flask for my mom the diy stuff so long day it's already seven but we're getting there. We are getting there. I made it here to Big Lots. And now hopefully if they have the boxes to put the gifts in. So hopefully that works out. Well, the, the fuck were they saying? I'm confused. I found the boxes that I needed and they're 25% off. I need the bigger boxes. These are medium. So I'll do these oh these are the prints or are these separate these are plain white i think these should work now that we got that let's go check out and head to target these are the moments where i'm like bro i don't need a train i need to get to the store i know you guys i'm low-key like not stressed but i literally was supposed to be at lands i was like at six to start everything and i know i'm just gonna start everything so late 
or if I just work on it tomorrow, as long as I set everything up for today. That's the important part. Okay, you guys, so after all the shopping, it's literally the day before Christmas, and I am finishing up the quick gifts for my family. So, for example, this hydro flask I got from my mom, and I decided to use my little pre cut machine, thanks to Alain for the little idea. And um, I'm gonna basically do a little DIY moment for this, so it could feel a little bit more like sentimental, you know, emotional attachment, I don't know, anyways. I am literally been trying to figure this out for the probably like last 30 minutes and you know i was like forget it let me do it how i literally know how to do it and that's what we're gonna go for i was using my computer but it got complicated so i'm using my phone right now i'm actually about to print out the first layer so that's what we're gonna do right now to do the next step after i unload it so i cut off this part right here so i could do the next set which is the little heart outline i'm gonna use the same white okay so it was low-key a little bit of a process that's literally fucking nine o'clock and it took me two hours just to do something very subtle like this look at how cute it turned out la mejor mama with cute little roses and the front has little cute hearts on it so i think this turned out really really cute so hopefully she loves it and I'm just going to continue on with doing the remainder of the stuff. And yeah. Update. I ended up going to the courthouse today. It is a Tuesday and it was actually a little packed, but it's okay. Not too bad. But you guys, I ended up paying another $25, which is okay. But I was like, wow, I guess the new fees that they were applying. The girl told me because I was like, what the? I just paid over the police station. And she was like, no, it's a new fee. So I was like, okay, whatever. So I paid that. And then I literally got a fucking stick in my fucking tire i got a not a flat but a middle rod was in my tire so i had to go get that patched just stuff has been going on today okay so this is the end of this video here i know you guys are wanting to see them opening up their gifts but guess what that's actually in the next video that will coming up soon i'm currently actually editing this first one right here which you guys are currently watching so hopefully you guys enjoyed this one here hopefully you guys enjoyed this video today i know it was it was literally a process at the end of you guys like i swear to you like lesson learned don't leave shit hanging like that and i didn't even know about the chuck's mom like that's just a crazy part to me to be honest but anyways good thing everything turned out good i am good to drive my car i am set and not scared to get pulled over anymore because i don't have all my information so anybody who wants to try to pull me over try me uh don't please i i swear to you uh, please i am a good driver i swear don't forget to like comment subscribe and share this video to anybody who you think is gonna have a great connection with us don't forget to follow me on all of my social medias at xo and over all my tits I love you guys so fucking much, and I will see you very, very soon. Happy holidays! Bye! Have a beautiful time!